From the Carl Chevrolet Studios in West Des Moines, welcome to Iowa Live. I am Lou, and it is that time to visit with New Horizon Academy. And you know when that happens, Kalina Bunnell is joining us. And this time of year, Kalina, is fun yeah. time of year. But first, we have some exciting news about New Horizon Academy. Another location? Yes, yeah, so we're adding a new location in Urbandale off 128th and Meredith. So you can visit our website. Um, we are doing tours at our other locations. You can get enrolled with us and we'll communicate a start date out and everything. So brand new school opening. We're super excited. That is awesome. Now let's remind everybody what services are being offered at New Horizon. Again. Yeah, so we offer care and obviously curriculum and education for children six weeks through pre-K. So mm -hmm. going off to kindergarten. Um, um, and we have some really great activities today. I hope you're ready to get messy. Oh, we are going to get messy. I'm yeah. looking forward. To, I look forward to this every year. <laughs> yeah, so we um, do a lot of STEAM activities within our center. So science, technology, engineering, art, and math. Mm -hmm. And um, we know children learn best through play, but also through investigation and discovery. So both of these activities really lend into those STEAM activities. And we're using all things that you can find at home, plus some other great resources from our blog. And you can find that on newhorizonacademy.net under our blog tab. Excellent. Now, you see these are starting to pop up. Grocery stores and yeah. uh, stands on the corner. Yeah, uh, maybe all you're over going to a pumpkin patch. Yes. We have this great resource, a pumpkin steam investigation sheet. Um, and this will just kind of guide you through some investigation with your children with a pumpkin. So um, first you're deciding, is your pumpkin small, medium, or large? Uh, small. Um, what is the color of your pumpkin? Uh, it's orange. And then you can color that. Um, circle the answer that best describes your pumpkin. Is it smooth, bumpy, or both? Uh, a little bit of both. I yeah, and yeah. see, I did bring some bumpy oh, yes. boards. I couldn't find a good bumpy <laughs> pumpkin. But, um, and then you can measure how tall your um, pumpkin okay, is with the ruler. Let's measure them. Uh, about eight and a half for the pumpkin, about, oh, I've got it backwards. There we go, seven, uh, four and a half for the pumpkin, about seven for the whole thing. Yeah, so using your math skills to use a ruler, teaching kids how to read the ruler. Which, uh, yeah, and like we just showed you, yeah. this is wrong. Okay, do it the right way. Yeah, it's hard for you, so yeah. <laughs> we have to teach them how to do it, right? And then you can weigh that on your scale. Maybe you have a small food scale at home too. It's also great to incorporate a magnifying glass, um, and maybe you can look at a pumpkin or a gourd that has a few more details, maybe is a little bit more bumpy. Ooh. The magnifying glass is great when you're cleaning out those pumpkins and you're getting into the guts and the seeds and everything that's inside the pumpkin. So too. really see what it's all about. How about, yeah. is that, here, look through the magnifying glass, everybody see that? That's cool, <laughs> isn't it? It's your finger. My nails need trimmed beside that. Okay, okay. Cool, um, cool. Yeah, and then this sheet also gives a chance to ask some questions about when you're getting ready to carve a pumpkin. All so, right. do you think the inside of a pumpkin is dry or wet? What do you think we'll find inside? You can draw a picture and then count the seeds and maybe roast them when you're done. There you go. All right, now speaking of pumpkins and big pumpkins, we're going to get a little messy. Yeah, so okay. we have a bigger pumpkin. Mm -hmm. I have cleaned this out mm -hmm. and it's full. Be careful, there's water. Okay, there's water. Um, right. So, it's full of about two thirds the way with water. There you go, see the water? Okay. And we're gonna add some more stuff inside okay, of it. Okay, what are we gonna add? Um, so we're going to add um, some baking soda and this is about six tablespoons of baking soda. Mm -hmm. uh, we're also going to add a couple drops. It's actually a teaspoon of Dawn, but the, the more the better. Dish soap, okay. Yeah, Dawn dish soap, any kind of dish soap. And then um, just a food coloring, whatever color you have. Okay. Um, maybe let's I like that. Side. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and then we are going to stir this up and just make sure that everything that we put in is well mixed and Ooh, spread around. Looking like a witch's brew. Yeah. Okay. So that is all thoroughly mixed. Everything's mixed. And then at this point, you can ask your child what they think will happen when you dump vinegar in. Vinegar. So this is scientific. Um, it's obviously a chemical reaction. Do we think that it'll stay this blue water material? What do we think? Okay, will and you see there's a, a tray around here just for the obvious yeah, reasons. So uh, ready? And then we have um, about a cup of vinegar. Okay. Da -da -da -dum. Voila. Oh, look at that! So it's How cool is that? And you can carve a face in the pumpkin. It would come out the face. 
<laughs> you can do it over the top. Again, I any color this. that you'd like. Um, the kids really like to see that. You could add more baking soda, more vinegar to kind of make a bigger volcano. The pumpkin volcano. Yes, yeah. Now, is this on the website at all? Um, all? Yeah, so this recipe is on the website and um, the directions, it has some great prompting questions for you to ask your child. That and, is awesome. Um, like I said, a really great activity. You probably have all these items in your pantry. Um, great for a fall rainy day when you're stuck inside. How about that? So more information on the great offerings at New Horizon Academy. You see the website newhorizonacademy.net and what we talked about today, you'll have your help sheets like here. Show that. Yeah, so all of all of our principals are on the blog tab there. Um, you can also look at all of our locations. You can schedule a tour there. That's awesome. Um, call and check with any of our center directors if you are seeking child care or maybe a career. All right, that is awesome. Kalina, thank you so much. Yeah, New you. Horizon Academy. All right, we are going to stick with the ooh, the creepy and crawlies. The Blank Park Zoo is coming up next, and you're going to meet Zelda. Oh, you're going to like Zelda. She's very cute. That's next on I Live.